So the way you can do that is you can click this, go to actions, go to image and templates and click on create image. So now it will ask you some basic information about the image. So let's call it web server and we can keep everything as it is. And AWS also recommends that you reboot the instance. That means while creating this image, it will reboot this instance once. So we are fine with that. So let's click on create image. So we'll see that currently it is creating the image for that. So for that, we'll have to wait for a couple of minutes. So to check it on the left side, you'll see the images section and AMI. So click on AMIs and you will see that this is the AMI that we just created and the status is pending. Okay, so we'll have to wait a couple of seconds so after a couple of seconds you can see the image is now available so now if you select this image you will see this option that says launch instance from image okay so let's click on that and what it's going to do is it's going to create an ec2 instance using that image so let's call it web so 2 okay and we can keep everything as it is and let's click on launch instance and it's asking us to select a key pair. So let's use the same key pair. And let's also enable the HTTP access and let's click on launch instance. So it is done. So now we have two instances, web server and the web server two. So let's wait a few seconds so that our web server two can also be initialized. So our web server two has been initialized as well. So let's click on that and copy the public IP. And let's see what happens. And as you can see, you can see the same website on this new IP as well. So now we have two identical servers. So again, this is the magic of AMIs. Okay. So if you have a server that you have configured and you want to share it with some other people, then you can create an image out of it and share that image with other people. So I hope you like this video. If you want to watch more such content around DevOps, do check out our channel DevOps Studio. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video if you like this content. And if you have any questions, please put them in the comment section. And I will see you in the next video.